Right guys, if you're looking to buy the cheapest and most reliable FIFA 22 Ultimate Team coins, make sure to head over to u7buy.com and buy yourself some coins from there. And also make sure you use code K101 at checkout for 5% off. Right guys, if you're wanting to make millions of coins without spending too much money or for free, look no further than my premium trading Discord. You get the best daily investments, tips, all that kind of stuff. If you're interested boys, the link is in the description join that and then you want to go to the how to join section when you get in there which is on the screen right now and then that will tell you a step by step on how to join the premium discord and uh yeah let's get into today's video right guys starting off with the first method of today's video it's going to be just normal gold let me just turn that off um well, that's special normal gold position any chem style any nation any league you want to go to the league one uber eats and then you want to go to Paris Saint-Germain, Bosch. Um, and these are currently going for, I think, 1.7K. I'm pretty sure. Um, let's have a look. Ah, But yeah, the reason why these are obviously quite expensive is because they're needed for the marquee matchups. Obviously, Man City played PSG and we beat them. I also went there. Um, so that was fun. But uh, yeah, so these go for 1.7K. And you've got literally, I'll show you what players you've got. Obviously, you've got New Mendes there, uh, Icardi 83, Paredes, Bernat, Kazawa. Mate, there's literally, there's probably like five to ten players that pop up here, which is sick. Um, so, yeah, 1.7k, you want to snipe really anything 1.5k and below. I mean, if you can pick a 450 coins, <laughs> that is going to be a dub, but you probably won't. But, yeah, you got to remember as well, some of these go for more than, you know, more than others um so players like you just seen there herrera i think he i think he goes for quite a bit more i think he goes for over 2k so you know if you do see someone like that just make sure to you know check his price and stuff or just someone you don't really see like this dagba i've not seen him pop up yet how much is he yeah so he's above 2k as well so that's what i mean by that and yeah they're popping up uh, quite a lot to be fair and i mean these are not hard to pick up and i'm you know i'm you're not making hundreds of coins per card, but you're making, do the maths, uh, you're making over 100 coins per card, which, I mean, they're, they're literally not, I'm not even sniping them. I'm literally just picking them up, so that's a dub. And obviously anything below 1.5 is going to be, you know, nice profit. So, yeah, pretty nice little method. Oh, Kira, how much are you? So, yeah, it looks, looks like the non-commons are a little bit more expensive. Dagba, that's a good snipe. Um, so, there we go. That's what I mean by... Uh, thingy so we'll have a look see how much Dagba goes for he looks to be around about two I'll probably go 2.1 I mean that's probably still too cheap but we can try 2.1 he maybe goes for a little bit more but you know if he sells instantly if I pick him up again obviously um, I'll um, I'll put him up for a little bit more but yeah, like I say these come up literally left right and centre which is a dub oh I should have picked that Bernat that's poor from me uh, I mean I thought Bernat would be more than that to be fair but yeah, oh, a little shadow on that as well. Um, so yeah, I think, like I say, these non-commons seem to go for a little bit, uh, a little bit extra. So I'm gonna go for like, you know, 1.9. And he also, I probably should have gone higher. He does have his shadow as well. Uh, and I think he actually is kind of usable. I'm not gonna lie. But yeah, I think we're gonna leave that there. Um, and then yeah, jump into the second method. I think some have already sold, or one has. And we picked up six players there in no time. So yeah, if I do get Adresa gone again next, that means, you know, I'll probably put him up for an extra 100 coins. Seems that he sold pretty quick. Uh, but, yeah, that is going to wrap up the first method. Let's get into the second one, a Roid now. Right, guys, so as you've seen in the first method, it was the marquee matchups that upped the price. So I'm going to go for the other team, which, as you know, is Manchester City. You want to go to gold, or literally any, to be honest. Uh, position, any, comes down, any, nation, any, league. You want to go Premier League, and then you want to go to, obviously, City. Um, and these are as well quite expensive, obviously, like I say, due to the marquee matchups. Um, so yeah, they're sitting around about I think 1.5, so 200 coins below, which is still quite good. Uh, and yeah, like I say, anything above half an hour means they sell. So these all these all will sell, uh, which is nice. And yeah, basically you want to be picking these up for 1.3 or below. Um, and yeah, you've got Zinchenko, Faran. You've got Ake, you've got, I think, Stones pops up, Gabby Jesus. So there's probably about five plus, maybe. Um, but the thing is with City, there's not like... 
City have a lot of players that are really high rated, so there's not actually as many as like PSG, but there's still quite a few. Stefan as well, I think, goes for a little, quite a bit more, to be honest, because I think he's literally the only non-common we've got. And Benjamin Mendy, but he's like 25k because he's in prison. Uh, so yeah, you've, there's loads of players you can pick up and literally snipe these for 1.3 and below. Um, and yeah, the good thing about this as well is these not uh, these normal gold commons. Oh dear, loads of them. These normal gold commons are you know, the same price as 83 rated, uh, which means you know you can be picking up Jesus and Fernandinho, which is nice. <laughs> but yeah, you want to try. These seem to be a little bit harder to pick up, but you know they're still doable. But you want to be picking these up, you know, for 1.2 if you can. I mean they're coming up quite a lot, so I might actually lower it to 1.2. Just to you know, make extra coins, might as well. Um, so yeah, if they're popping up like that, where literally a whole page has just popped up, I would lower it down a hundred coins and try pick them up for obviously one point two. They're going to be oh, I've bottled that. They're going to be a little bit harder, but they're still definitely you know going to be able to pop up, and you know you should be able to pick them up, and you do make an extra hundred coins. So you know it's like basically picking up two cards instead of one. You know. Oh, 1k, that would have been nice. But yeah, I think that is going to wrap up the second method. Pretty nice one. Obviously, I'd probably say the PSG one's a bit better, just because there's more players. Uh, but yeah. Ah, oh, bold that, man. But yeah, PSG aren't better in real life, that's all I'm going to say. But yeah, that is going to wrap up the second method. So let's jump into the final one, Aroid now. Right, guys, jumping into the last method of today's video. It's going to be a gold rare position you want to go to right back. Can we start any nation you want to go down to England and then league you want to uh, go to the Premier League and these are current actually no you don't want to go Prem leave the Prem because you can pick up Trippier I just forgot about that these are very expensive <laughs> as you can tell they're over 2.3k two which is mental I don't know why I generally don't have a clue um, I, I literally have no clue why these are 2.4k but I mean I'm not complaining it's a snapping filter so why not but yeah, uh, these are sitting around about 2.4, 2.5. So obviously, if you want to go 2.5, they're not going to sell instantly. But if you go 2.4, they'll probably sell or they'll sell a lot quicker. Um, so I'm going to go 2.4 just for this video. And then you basically want to be picking them up for... Oh, that's what I mean by, you know, don't go Premier League. So you can pick up Trippier. Boom, 1.1k. But uh, yeah, what was I saying? Uh, 2.4, so you can lose 120 coins per card. So you can go down 200 which I probably I probably go down 300 to be honest. You're making 80 coins per card, but I probably go down a little bit more just to make those, you know, 180 instead of 80. So I go down to 2.1, uh, and these should pop up an oat like you know a decent amount, um, you know, just because they're quite low rated. They are quite packable as well, and you know they're English. They're from the Prem, or some of them are. So you know people will definitely list these or have a look, see how much they're going for. So yeah. I think some of the most of the usable as well. Fredericks is quite usable. Ah, but yeah, they're going to be obviously a little bit harder to pick up if you do, um, you know, snipe 2.1. But if you go 2.2, they're going to be, you know, pretty easy. So it's up to you what you want to do with that. But uh, yeah, I think that is going to wrap up today's video, though, boys. Three very nice methods. I'm going to have a double upload today as well. So yeah, watch out for the video later on. And uh, yeah, if you did enjoy, please do smash the like button, subscribe, all that good stuff. And uh, yeah, look, already five players have sold there, which is nice. So yeah, double use. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.